Anapir, right? Anapir. So Anapir, remember anatomical position. Anatomical position. So if I thrust, it's A to B. If I flip it, B to A. So depending upon whatever carpal bone it is, and remember the carpal bones? Mm -hmm. right? Some lovers try positions that they can't handle. Yeah. Never, never lower Tilly's pants. Mother make him home. <laughs> 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 oh, that one That's the old name. So. You're going to be a hit on YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta edit some of this stuff. <laughs> All right, so we would find whatever one is in question, whatever carpal bone. We take our thumb. We you know take a, you can take a little bit of tissue pull, reinforce your it's other the orange. Yeah, the other fingers are distal. You can see they're distal to my contacts. <coughs> right. So now and and, then, and I could use my fingers here just to stabilize. Can you do this hand? Because I think it needs. Excellent. Okay, doctor. Yeah, self-diagnosed. Yep. Right, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring him into extension, and then I'm going to start to bring him into flexion. When I bring him into flexion, there's also a little bit of distraction, and once you feel you have this, you know, it's a, kind of like a short little snap, right? Just a quick little, it's not so short, no? You're on the loony? Yeah, I was on the loony, yeah. Right, and you you know, these fingers behind here kind of separate a little bit this way. This stabilizes these fingers here, and this is reinforcing. And you're, you know, you're trying to open up and gap open that area. You can feel it moving here. And you had a, you know, a short little whip. Right? I could hit one of a snap off a snake's head.